So this is where I'm supposed to tell you the story of uh, the underpants. The nights that I couldn't find a place to stay or somebody to be with, um, I would generally come hang out at the park. There's a bunch of benches around here. Um, and then when it would rain, as it so often does in, in Orlando, I'd, uh, I'd go right underneath there. Um, this is different because this whole walkway wasn't here. So it was much higher and uh, none of these cool rocks uh, that I remember were down there. This was like overgrown. Um, so I'd go underneath there and I'd, and I'd sleep. Um, there's a flat part in there. It was always funny because you'd wake up and you'd think you're going to fall down into the, into the, into the water. How does it feel to be back here? It sucks. It really sucks. It's the one thing I didn't want to do. When you're making a movie and when you're planning on this trip, like you just, you, you separate yourself. But like flying over Orlando and hearing, you know, we're 60 miles away and we're on our, far, you know, our final descent, it hit home, you know? I've been back to Orlando since my mother passed, but I never come to Lake, Lake Underhill, I never come down to East West. Like I just find ways to get around it. Like I never came back to face this. But I didn't even go to my mom's funeral. I did whatever I could to not have to deal with this. I didn't even know where my mother was buried. I, I just, I, I'm not, emo I've never been emotionally equipped to be able to face all of that. So knowing that the purpose of me being here wasn't to go to Disney, but was to like deal with this, it sucks. I am Rotimi Rainwater. I am a former homeless youth. This is the bridge I used to sleep under, and I am still lost in America.